Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to review for you this uh, spray mop from Aquapur from, uh, from Lidl, available at Lidl. And uh, this review will be split in two parts, first it will be theoretical, then we will move uh, into a practical part of the test. So, uh, what you are paying for, it's a, a spray mop that has uh, included uh, two uh, cleaning pads, two types of cleaning pads. Uh, one is for wet, second is for dry. And actually, to be honest, I need to double check which is which because uh, this is, a, I would say, softer, quite, quite nice. And this is a little bit, let's say, harder. And uh, actually, straight away, I don't, uh, I don't know which is what. Before doing the practical test, I will double check it. Uh, if I could assume, I would uh, put money, I, I would say, I if I could, should bet, I would put money on this softer type, but who knows. What I have noticed straight away, it's uh, in terms of quality, uh, both of them are dirty. Not some signi in significant way, but um, where it was, uh, yeah, you see some leftovers, I don't know which is, what is this. But uh, I have spotted yeah, here as well. I would say small thing, but annoying that you are getting dirty parts, dirty parts uh, straight away from the from from box. And box didn't it, it was not open uh, at shop because sometimes you can face that uh, uh, buying an appliance. Uh, you, you actually, somebody uh, before you open the, the box just to take a closer look what is inside. Okay, let's move on. Uh, second, uh, in terms of uh, this uh, container for uh, for water for detergent, it's almost uh, half a liter, or, it, or it's a, it is uh, I would say precisely half of a liter. And uh, this equipment uh, can uh, can uh, covers I would say uh, I mean those parts can be clean. Uh, up to 40 degrees Celsius, so rather soft cleaning. And actually we are uh, getting into uh, my biggest concern. Uh, everything what you are buying it has a three years warranty, I would say decent. But I couldn't find a spare part, because those parts will be, I, I would say, soon. Uh, will need it to, to, to be replaced, so actually spare parts it's a uh, weakest point. Uh, how you install them? Easy. I have, uh, let's say, mixed feelings in terms of uh, surface coverage because, um, okay, those are quite small. And if you press it down, it should touch, I mean, the whole surface should have a contact. Uh, what else about features? You have a flexible I don't, I don't know how to call it, but you can, according to the uh, Aquapur, you can try to maneuver beyond, or not beyond, uh, underneath the, the couch or some kind of chairs and uh, in any, uh, in any um, parts or any, 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 anywhere that it's, uh, it's hard to maneuver. So. I'm taking as a granted. Okay, uh, I didn't assemble it, so it will be as well uh, my first time, so we, you will be able to see is it easy or not. Okay, plug and play. Uh, what I do like is this, this hook. Simple thing, but after using it, you can uh, just hang it away somewhere, so very good uh, feature. Uh, spray container, we are actually starting uh, spraying by using this bar. So, yeah. Easy plug and play, almost easy. A little bit force it's required. Okay, now let's move into a practical test, and you will see how it's uh, uh, how it's behaving.
as a summary uh, for me it's a little bit too complicated I really like this uh, flexible uh, thing this flexible extension could be uh, for some someone of you some of you uh, interesting and the spraying feature I'm not so convinced uh, really about uh, the practicality it's okay it's spraying the, the detergent the, the water uh, all over the place but isn't doing the, the job properly I have doubts I'm curious about your opinion and as always thank you for watching stay tuned and see you next time bye